So hi guys, this is the first episode of Planch vs From Liver, which is gonna be a series on this your most favorite challenge. Oh, As you know, there's an incredible hypocrisy when we talk about From Liver and Planch. When we see competitions, we see guys like Valentin do perfect, incredibly protracted, and super good hip position planches. And then we see the same guy doing front lever with Ben Parents. That is not his fault. That is fault of everyone, of me, of you, of every fucking person in street workout. Because we are letting judges to take this like this. And when a person sees a planche like this and a planche like this, they give like huge immense difference to this planche than to this planche. And you know, like it's it's the correct thing to do. But when it comes to front lever, we see shit like this, and we see shit like this, and they are the, the exact same points. And what we say to this, we say, fuck you, judges, because you need to know what you're doing. And this is not a specifically a beef for anyone, or for somebody that I have in my mind. Well, maybe I have someone in my mind, but I'm not gonna tell you, because you are not worthy. Why I am doing this criticizing? The first reason is because I want to change street workout in a positive way. First thing I want to say is we need to know what the fuck is locking out your elbows and what is retracting scapulas and protracting scapulas. Protracting scapulas is a very often and common topic these days. Guys like Levan and guys like Valentin are spreading the world like Jesus world all around the world when we talk about protracting. But there are really few persons that talk about retracting and how to activate your high back muscles to get a proper retraction. The first tip to do this is to just think about chesting out. Instead of trying to muscle mind connect your scapulas to the moves you want to do, the thing you need to do is just to think about chest. It's like the semi protraction. If you want to protract, you just need to think in chest in, or I don't know how to say that, but whatever. In retraction, you just need to chest out. You just need to get out your chest while you're doing perfect lockout. That's another topic we need to discuss. It's so much easy to retract when you are doing bent elbows. So much easy. You need to try and you will realize. Here we can see Money Workout, a guy that is very well known because of the clean way he does his stuff. He is a very good example of what everyone should do if we want to do clean style. He does protracted planches and he does retracted from levers. I don't want to say that everyone should be clean, everyone has his style and I respect that. Every athlete has his own and his perfect way to do things in his opinion, but I'm not gonna interfere with that. I want to touch another topic. When it comes to freestyle, everybody knows that front lever athletes are not very well known in that world. In the opposite situation, we have Eric Ortiz, one of the best planters in the world, doing He's very well known planches, he does Patriot against, he did Patriot against the battle between Tony Gays. I'm actually not sure if he, if he locked out his elbows. But whatever, most of freestyle athletes are doing planches. But when it comes to front lever, most of the of these same athletes are just doing 3 second front lever with bent arms and neutral scapulas. Why is this happening? The, the situation is not that they are not good at front lever. Most of them have front touch. Uh, really decent Victorian and I don't know when are pull-ups but the thing is that when it comes to freestyle you're doing a lot of pulling while you're doing 360 or 720 or Halley hoop. Halley hoop is a very very good example. So the thing that we need to get in our fucking minds is that I'm gay. No, the thing is that Elias is and that we need to understand that front liver gets so much tired. So much tired and planche does it too but not as much as front lever because when we're doing 720 we're, we're not doing this to do 720 we're doing fucking this and that's pulling and mostly dynamics with clean form are done with straight arms and that gets lots way more tired what i suggest i suggest that we educate judges to understand this because most of the judges i don't want to say specific names but well, I'm gonna say it anyway. Jordan Bioko. Well, I'm not gonna say more names. <laughs> These guys don't really know the difficulty of the exercises. If a person like Victor Chavez does a floor beak in 
Street Workout Ultimate Battles, what points are they gonna give to him? They are gonna probably give less points than a full planche and a victory on the floor is like four or five times is like more difficult than a fucking planche even in soup you know and even in perfect form so this is everything for today's episode i hope you enjoy it and remember this is not to criticize to any specific athlete just jordan Biel. now now it's a joke but this this is not to criticize for destroying people this is trying to be positive to community because I want people to understand how important for a lever is and how hypocrite, 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 hypopotamus, how hypopotamus were being towards a beautiful element like for a lever. And I love planches. I'm not very good at planches. But the thing is that we need to love each element and understand it and not be so incredibly straight. 